And that was the beautiful Christy Lamb there with Pass Me a Lighter. Don't forget, Christy has her Christmas calendars out. Well, her calendars are out ready for your Christmas Wouldn't stocking fillers. Wouldn't they be Christy Miss calendars? Christy calendars. Wouldn't they be Christy Miss calendars? Yeah, good on you. Oh. There's one in every crowd, and I'm sure there's been one in many cars as well, talking about cars. This is a first time tonight, Trace. We're catching up with Bill yeah, Gray. Time. And uh, it's the first time we've had a chance of speaking with Bill, and he joins us now. Bill, thanks for joining us tonight, and uh, congratulations on the single, The Car. No worries. Thanks, guys. Fairly new as far as you went to the college there at Tamworth a couple of years ago. What's been your experience so far with country music? It's been great so far. I did the college, I think it was 2014. Since then, I've been, I've been pretty much flat out. I've been doing festivals all over Victoria and New South Wales, South Australia, and, and around my hometown of Geelong. It's been, it's been very constant, and it's been really good, yeah. Now, you've got a bit of history doing a few tribute shows too, Merle Haggard, Dwight Yoakam, that sort of stuff. Yeah, I do them whenever whenever required, but I'm a big fan of both those guys. I've, I reckon they're, they're fantastic, and I, I can't really sing their stuff enough, I don't think. Well, it's a good base for, uh, you know, to be coming out and being a country music singer, to have those, and particularly in your repertoire. Yeah, no, it is. It's, it's great. A, a lot of the festivals I do, the, the guys like the old stuff that they know and they're familiar with, and the Merle songs and the Dwight songs, they always go down well. They get, get plenty of dances up and they always seem to have a good response. You must enjoy the opportunity to do your original stuff. I do, I do. I've got, I've got a soft spot for my originals and every chance I get I'll, I'll slip one in or I'll do a, a whole bracket of originals. Yeah, I, that's where my heart lies really in the original stuff. I've been writing songs ever since I started playing the guitar, which was well, probably way back when I was about 15 or so. A long time. But to be honest, I've got hundreds of songs that are finished and probably the same amount that are unfinished. I've got a whole suitcase full of them and they're in the drawers in my study and there are a few in the car and a few in the guitar case. So never short of short of, a, of an original there somewhere. Have you ever taken two songs? I say something that you wrote maybe... 10, 15 years ago and then you're writing a song today, have you ever thought, oh wait a minute, there's something in a song that I did write, have you ever gone back and had a look and taken parts from other songs to create a brand new one? Well yeah, I, I certainly have, it's always fun to look through your old stuff and you, you find things that are unfinished and then you find something new that's a little bit, you know, might, might fit in here or fit in there and you, you mix them together a little bit and it, and it ends up uh, being quite good sometimes. I reckon it'd be great if you could mix a heartbreak song and a love song together. She loves me but she's sleeping with my best friend. Well, <laughs> <laughs> that's the yeah, next that's side. Pretty good. I have got a song called "I Really Love You," but I, but I, but I love your sister more. <laughs> that's the next single. It's got to be. We need yeah, a copy of on. that up here. Bit more about you. They'd see that uh, you you got a few secrets hidden, like uh, Tracy does. She's a black belt in origami, you know, so she's <laughs> lethal with a piece of paper. Um, oh, but but you've got a few martial arts up your sleeve as well, don't you? Yeah, look, I've been in the martial art industry since I was 16. Got black belts in, in a few different styles there, so it uh, always keeps me fit and keeps me mobile, so it's good. So if you go along to a Bill Gray yeah, show, don't, don't heckle, heckle him. him. No, no, I don't, I don't like to get heckled too much. I usually usually upsets me, and I just want to pack up and go. Well, Bill, we're not going to heckle you tonight. We're going to congratulate you on your single, and uh, we're going to give the give the song a spin. Now, if people like you, they can visit the website, the Facebook page, and uh, and you also get hold of your music and find out when you're going to be in their town. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, just either of those things, Facebook or a website. You just type my name in and then put the word music after it, and a whole bunch of stuff will, will pop up. Mate, great to catch up with you tonight. Thanks very much for your time, and this is Bill Gray and the Car. Sing my daddy.